what's going on guys today we're back playing detention this is part three so let's go ahead and jump right into it all right from uh what i remember we i think woke up again now we're i guess trying to unlock this door because these are the guys that are like before you walk in to see death this is who you meet from the last thing i remember so know where we go to next we probably have to go back i would think or maybe not because i don't remember this part during summer break the boys in class will use this as their battle tank unfortunately they quickly broke the wheels is there something in it a puppet theater on a hand-drawn card is there something else okay i don't see nothing else so we'll just keep it pushing into this are we back in the school again that's what it looked like for a second. Uh, that's not creepy at all. Oh, that's most definitely creepy. What's in here? Uh, matches right there. A brick furnace. I remember back then, Mom said she burned spirit money to bless her health and good fortune. I always thought of it as a closer, as closer to dealing with the devil. Yikes. Okay. Is there something I need to throw in there? This doesn't do anything. Okay, so obviously we have to find something to burn it. <clears throat> I gotta remember my spots this time, because for some reason I'll be forgetting my spots where I'm at all the time. I can't remember if I'll be on the third floor, first floor, or second floor. I don't remember. Can I go through this door? It was locked. This should lead to the to the what? I didn't I didn't see that word. I thought it said auditorium, but it didn't look long enough to be auditorium. Okay, we went upstairs. Where did we come from exactly? The roots are growing out of this seams. The door's completely blocked. What is this? Do we need a key for it? This goes up the roof. The gate is locked. Okay. So right now we have like two different things we need to get into. And maybe we need to put the fire out. Maybe that's what it is. Uh, pungent mossy smell permeate, permeates. Uh, let's go in here. Since this is the only place I see we can go in. Where's the door at? Where did I just walk into? There are various films on the rack. They seem to be all tangled together. That looked like a dead body for a second. I guess film in the media room is being projected from here. Our military education class often play political propaganda and the instructor always has a million things to say about whatever happens to the film. Any films I could play? I don't know. Just told me they were all tangled together. I don't even see where the door is at. All right, so there's a furnace. A locked door, and now there's films that we need to play. Let's figure out what's in here. Oh, sweet. The creepy film being played. Uh, unmarked grave embodied in the middle of the room. Shouldn't be anything buried underneath. There are three unlit incense sticks here. Take incense? What the freak? Okay, I don't receive the incense. What does that read, though? The grave of Wei Chang Chung Ting, a oh, right way he already is the legacy of the deceased always just a mere rock. I don't know, bro. What does this read? When did all this writing appear? Oh, that's creepy as freak. Did we like shut that? Or is all moldy? So you can reason leave your death in the hands of others. Hmm. All right, so we have incense. So the only thing I could think is that we need to go put that in the fireplace. <laughs> oh my gosh. Like, am I, can I walk by him? <laughs> oh. Nope. You cannot walk by him. How are you even supposed to get by him then? We're back here again. Sweet. I don't even know where I'm at. <sighs> I thought maybe I had to do it like I, I mean, it didn't give me directions like uh, the lantern spirit once roamed as I lingered and now serves the underworld due to due to dutifully. <clears throat> I'm sorry, man. My my <laughs> talking to be weak. This is stress cries of the weak. When you finish yourself, find yourself powerless. You choose to harm those who are for real. Okay. 
All right, we're back where we save. Do I still have my incense? I do. Okay, cool. All right. So obviously we need something to open that door, but I still don't know what. So keep it pushing this way, chick. We need to go up to the. You see, I done forgot. Is it the first floor I need to go to? What's that? There's a note in the car. A lantern inspector. Uh, was I supposed to die in him? A lantern spirit. An illustration of the lantern spirit. If you ch if you chance upon a lantern spirit, oververt your gaze and stand unmoving. When it comes near, steal your breath. Do not panic. It will keep moving. Okay. That would be nice to see like when I first was here. Okay, what's in this room again? I can't remember. Maybe this is the furnace. Yeah, I think it is. Alright, so this is the furnace room. Let's see if I can put the incense in here. And then we set it at Way's grave, maybe? This doesn't do anything. There's something right there. What is that? A brick furnace. Okay, never mind now. I don't know. Maybe we won't do nothing with the furnace yet. I don't know what the incense is for, though. Here was something I could look at. What is this? The glass beakers here are from our biology lab. They are holding each, each, they are each holding a puppet inside. Yeah. Let's, uh, I think we've gone everywhere. So we'll go downstairs this time. I'm gonna talk to the creepy dude locked up, a kneeling figure with a wooden token on his back. Can't really tell who it is with a hood on his head. Wooden stocks and shackles, a bit of dried blood on the edges. Okay, there goes another one. Kneeling figure, there's some blood on his hands. What the freak is this? What is it? The temple's divine incense burner. Before we pray, Mom always lights three incense sticks. She tells the gods her name and birthplace, then launches into a spiritual dribble. She often lays her many problems and wishes upon them. Why does she not tell a real person that they fall upon a visible god? Stick that right there, maybe? Yeah, I do as Mom does with the incense in her hand, ignoring the kinds of prayers she'd prefer. Ask you guys only for a way to live as myself. What was that sound? I'm taking one of the gates open, but I want to walk this way because I never finished looking at everything. What is this one? Another kneeling figure. Who are they supposed to be? We have no clue. Dang, how far does this room go? Spirit money. Oh, burn the spirit money in the furnace, right? Let's see what the door is. It's locked. Okay. Oh my gosh. Why is he out? What the fruit was that? This hill's empty, smelling like rotten plants. Okay. Being creepy as crap, bro. I know I heard one of these doors unlocked. Now I figure there's some blood on his hands, okay? His door unlocked. Prison gate is open, the wooden token on, his, on the statue's back is loose. Okay, what do I use a token for? One token taken from the figure in the basement cell? I don't know what the token's for. I'm trying to think, but I really don't know. I know right here, we'll burn the spirit money. Burn the spirit money, and hopefully it'll give us something. My game just lagged. All right, uh, spirit money. Oh, uh, otherworldly spirits offer the spirit money to ask for your protection. Okay, the fire went out. The furnace suddenly has gone cold and something's in there. I can speed it. Should have been reduced to ash if it was inside. What is it? A feathered fan. Fan made of feathers. It appeared to the furnace after burning. I don't know why it was still intact inside. Okay. What's that? <laughs> what was... Did the puppets just kill me? Is that supposed to crouch or something? Is there a crouch? I don't think there's a crouch in this game. I'm just like dying to everything. Is there a crouch button?
I just realized that she follows my cursor and I've been sitting here. Wait, no, maybe she doesn't. Why was she just following my cursor? Then? She was literally just following my cursor. Okay, that was trippy. These human like objects are filled with evil, evil over time. Yeah, I figured it out, bro. Figured out after the puppets peep me up and choke slam me. Foul thoughts gather and accumulate until they one day take on a life. I don't know. They begin to twist into monstrous storms. I don't know. They be hitting me with a lot of knowledge and I just can't think about that right now. But I'll run it there yet. No, don't. Oh my gosh. Oh, 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 I know what it, I know what I need to do. Plant. Oh, okay. Put the totem in there. Put the book in there. Put my necklace in there. Uh, hold my breath? I don't know. Is there a crouch key? What about holding my breath? Does holding my breath do anything? It does. But is she going to be able to hold her breath long enough? Is a real question. Oh, girl. Oh, I'm about to pass out. And she's going to get... Oh, thank the Lord. I had me sweating for a sake because I thought she weren't going to make it. I thought right at the end they were going to pick me up, choke slamming me. Okay. Let's go back this way and check out that door because I don't remember what that door needed. Pope court. I think that car is starting. Something's, something's probably going to happen with that car. Oh, I think that's where I came from right there. Now that I look at it. Let's go ahead and save. Yes, please. We got a good bit of stuff right now, and I ain't trying to lose any of it. Let's see what this is. Is there a way? Can I put this here? No. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Ah! Look at me! A chill air drifts inward. Alright, let's head into the creepy door room where death is. Oh, we're running out of prompts. I don't know if I checked everything in that building before. But it is what it is. What is this? God, these rooms just keep getting creepier and creepier, bro. Oh my gosh. What's up, here? The camera looks familiar. There's a key inside. Roof key. Alright, that's at the first place. I remember that. See what's here. There's nothing important on the bookshelves. Nothing important on the bookshelves. Let's check the telephone out. Can I call somebody? Is this phone from the principal's office? I don't know, bro. Maybe I need to find a, nom a phone number to call. Mm, go this way. <laughs> uh, look away. Hey, come walking this way. Hold my breath. And they should walk right by me. All right, I'll hold my breath. Oh my gosh. Walk by! I'm gonna pass out. Oh my gosh, I was about to pass out. Why do they do that? Why do they have to stand there and sniff? I wonder how long I can stand there before she actually decides to pick me up. What is it? Oh, there's a door right here. Okay. Go in this room, I guess. Alrighty. A puppet. In the middle of the room hangs a bird cage. A puppet lies light inside. It's got a hood on. I've never seen this style before. Yeah, I don't know what to do with that. Something wrong with the piano. Maybe there's a, a thing we need to learn. Okay, maybe there's a thing we need to learn. So we need to go somewhere and find out. We got the key to the roof. I got to remember that. So we know something's going to be on the roof. Uh, let's just keep it pushing forward. We're going to clear all the way out. See if we find anything else. If we don't find anything, then we head to the roof. Figure out what's there. 
faces of people in the tree. The trees are growing through the wall. There are leaves all over the room. Moss grows on the door and windows. You're not going to talk about the, the faces on the... You're not going to talk about the faces? Um, a large 8-track player. It's usually used for school broadcasts. The power's connected. Do I just need to stick an 8-track tape in? Dude, there's a lot going on. You used to have usually those 4-tracks recorded on it. I have to remember all this, bro, is wild. I'm not going to lie. I know I'm going to forget something. There's a door. I guess we'll go out this door. This place is huge. Oh my gosh. Where is this leading me to? The door hasn't been unlocked. Oh, oh, okay. I know what this is. Ah, yes. This is the door we were locked in in the first place. All right. Let's go. Uh, We'll use the key on it. Let's go upstairs all the way. Yeah, let's head up there. Is that me? That's me. Come back, me. I forgot what my name is. But what? Oh my gosh. That is. That was unsettling. Um, but. We got a projector out of it. Or a tape for the projector. I can't remember where the projector's at. I, th I believe it's this way. If old girl with the lamps over here, then it is this way. I don't believe it is. Oh, it is. Yes. Okay, cool. Yeah, I got a film right here. I wonder what's co contained in the film. I don't really want to know if you want me to be completely honest with you. It's going to be a number or something that we're going to have to... Type in. I believe. Uh, zero two five one two one zero two five one zero two five one two one. Can I like? I have to remember this. Or am I gonna watch it? Am I gonna say something about it? Okay, zero two five. I, I, hold on, give me a second. Let me write this down real quick. Cause there's no way I'm gonna remember this. All right. Start. Okay, zero two five. Five one two one. I believe. Hold on, one more time. Zero two five. Right. One. Two. One. All right. So we got that. But the only issue is going to be is, do I write it like that or will I write it in, you know, their little code for the numbers? No, no, no. The code for the numbers is literally just to read that one thing. That's my B. All right. Um, we need to go to the telephone. And I believe that's the first room. So we'll go downstairs twice, I believe. One more time. Nope, 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 not one more time. Right here. And we need to go to the room with the telephone, which I believe is the first room on the west side room, through the door. I think. I said uh, my memory, it fades sometimes. I'll be forgetting. But hopefully I'm, I'm choosing correctly here. There was something I could look at. No, maybe there wasn't. Through the door, girl. Across the way. Oh, am I? My girl threw herself out. I remember that. Uh, creepy room. Let me remember the number because I don't want to sit here and try to remember. Zero two five one two one. Zero. Okay, we'll pick the receiver up then, girl. Zero. I, I don't know how this works. Zero? Hold on, I don't know how it works. Bro, what? Bro! It just stopped! Z 
zero, two, five, two, one. That didn't work. Why is this so janky right now? Okay, I have to pick up the receiver to dial. Okay, go ahead. Look. Zero. Two. Five. Two. One. Zero, two, five. Oh, zero, two, five, one, two, one. Zero, two, five, one, two, one. Zero. Okay, I got it, I got it, I got it. Zero. No. Hold on. Cause stop, cause you're getting on my nerves. I can't tell if I'm hitting it right or not. Zero. Two. Alright, we got it. Thank God. Somebody pick up the phone, man. Miss Bang, your country appreciates your assistance. Okay. What's left is only a dial tone. What happened? What happened? Oh. The creepy guy with the bag. I'm supposed to walk out there now? After he done beat on it and everything? Got a doll. Military police puppet? Put a bit on the hallway just as the military policeman is holding a pistol in his hand. I don't even know what I'm supposed to do with this. Can I read any of that? Uh, something I can read right here. Metal door inside, there might be a, another way around. Okay. See, I didn't know nothing about that. What's in this room? Because I don't know. Alright, uh, this is that puppet. <sighs> um, I don't know, put that. This doesn't do anything, okay. Oh, the piano, I forgot. Oh, I put a. Okay, that doesn't do anything. I see this right here. Nah. Anything to look at? There's something back this way. We have a music class because we have semesters. Must have used a testing center there. Okay. Keep it pushing to the next spot now. Puppet. I'm trying to think why you need the what I even need the puppet for. The barcode room. There are some playback devices inside. Is there any? Wait, no. Is there anything I can use? Uh, this picture of empty. You come here whispering. Uh, lose my scrolls on the windows and doors. This doesn't do anything. I don't even know. I'm lost with the puppet right now. Actually. <gasps> I'm gonna wait a second before it gets to me because I don't want to lose my breath. Alright. So I can literally get right there to where that lantern hits me. Then I can go. Alright, we good. Oh, keep going. I don't think I'll, okay. I can't go all the way. Okay, I remember I, no. Where did I just go? What is this? Oh, this is new. 
I didn't know I could go in here. Ah, the puppet goes right in here. Oh. Yeah, you go right here. Do you not? This doesn't do anything. A pair of mannequin hands. It's a setup for the puppet player. Oh, okay. So I need to find the other puppet. Sweet. Something I haven't found yet. But I didn't know I could go this way. Maybe I find the other puppet over here. Please. Playback device. Eight track tape. Okay. Was this here before? Because I do not remember this at all. I think I would have ran over it with my finger if I would have, I mean, with the mouse if I would have seen it. Well, it's good that I found it. Or literally to just randomly decide to go right there. Let's go back this way. And I see Graves, baby. I wonder where I am. This wasn't that man gonna be here, is it? Why did that just happen? That's creepy as freak, bro. What's this room again? Okay, broadcasting room. Yeah, I need to go in here. It's too dark to see anything. What the freak does that have to do with anything? I guess flip the switch, please. Oh my gosh. Oh! Uh! That scared the freak out of me. All right, let's put the tape in. Let's start the tape. Push. I don't speak this. I don't speak Korean, so I don't know. Weird. Is it stuck? Can't change tracks anymore. He's repeating the same notes. Weird, is it stuck? Am I supposed to remember that? Hold on. I don't know, bro. I'm going to take a... I'm going to try something. It sounds like they're going low to high. Oh, it's playing over everything. Oh, okay. That's better. I'm sitting here trying to memorize the doggone notes. I'm like, bro, there's no way that's going to happen. But it doesn't play in here. Sweet. I'm here. Oh man, I'm not. I'm nice. I'm nasty, bro. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Just give me the doll, bro. Yeah. All right. Take it out. What the free, bro? Just give me the doll, bro. A detached twist and finger for completely rubbed off. Okay. But I mean, like, we're going to act like I just didn't clutch that. I didn't cheat or anything, bro. I could leave the whole gameplay of me trying to figure it out, but I'm not. But did not cheat. I clutched that all the way up. Like, I literally did that. And I'm very proud of myself because... I'm not saying that's the hardest puzzle ever, but it's kind of difficult trying to memorize the sound of it and then turning around and walking back. You know, some people just don't got 
don't got a mindset like that. You know what I'm saying? They're not that good when it comes to, you know, they're tone deaf. Me, I'm not. I got it like that. Oh. Sweet. That key fell out of Puppet's body. Yeah, we'll take that. Basement key. I'm glad they named it, but I did remember. It, so I wouldn't have... That wouldn't have been too, 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 too hard for me. I would have remembered that, for sure. Remember the basement. All right. You know, something's creepy about to happen because we just... I unlocked another little... What's his name? Please don't jump out at me. Thank you, sir. Kind sir. Okay. Just make sure nothing creepy's happening. Please no. Nothing scary, please. Don't jump scare me. Thank you. It's one good thing about this uh, game is like it's not very jump scare reliant. It's just scary in general. Atmosphere and everything is just creepy. Like even like when she's staring at you when she comes out like that, like that's creepy. Like why? Why do you have to look that weird? That's scary. This might be behind that middle cage that we're trying to get to. What happened? Oh, it's us and Wade. Wade, thanks for doing this for me. Not at all. I'm willing to help if you ask. Though I'm sorry to have to drag you all the way here to my classroom. It's okay. My classroom is individual studies now. It'd be a bother if we were there. You sure nobody else knows about these meetings, right? Of course, miss. Absolutely not. One thing, though. This book list is quite sensitive in material. Please be careful with it. Yes, thanks for the reminder. I know reading these books could be trouble. But it should be our freedom to pursue knowledge, right? Yeah, I'm with you on that. Uh, in fact, I think Miss Yan also said something like that before. I think you're just like her. You're both courageous and, and talented. You think we're alike? I can't compare to her anyways. She's the principal's daughter, and they're known to be a family of successful scholars. That's okay. I believe she thinks highly of you. I remember she gave your work a nice compliment once. She said, Strength, uh, strengthen those wings, the sky's the limit. She really said something like that. Hey, let me ask you a question. I see Miss Yen and Mr. Chang chat a lot. Do you maybe know what kind of relationship they have? You know what? She was doing something like against prop, like probably something wild about propaganda. I put everybody left hand by way book club reading list. Um, that is a gun. I've been weak, but you once told me the pen is mightier than the gun. But I think she might have got him killed because she was doing some outlandish, like she was trying to do something like for the commies, because you know they're obviously against commies. Why am I walking? What's going on? Am I about to learn something out about way? Something about to hit. Not these, not the mirrors. What the freak is that? Miss Yen, what, what are you doing over here? As a teacher, I always show concern for students who are a little rebellious. Remember what you did? What? Have you forgotten or do you not want to remember? You? Just a harmless piece of paper, right? Instead, I had to die. He had to die and many other students had to die. Was it you? You just kept causing me trouble. You're driving me crazy. Sometimes when you trip up, you're never able to get back up again. How dare you? This is all because of you. You ruined everything. If you had a problem, why couldn't you have come talk to me instead? Shut up. If you were gone, none of this would have happened. What the freak? If you weren't here, all would be well. I'm confused. So did she like, were they all known as like, were they like commie lovers or something? And like, they didn't like that. Justice Chang Young. 
mom likes to bring all her worries and concerns to you, something I think is fruitless, but sometimes there's no one else to look for help. My hands together in silent prayer here are my questions. I, Fang, Ray, Shin, invoke your guidance. Ask about prospects. Ask about family. Ask about love. Let's do the first one. Will I be able to live a simple life with loved ones and family? Yen Po, the crying answer. Do not seek what cannot be. Ah, this was just a humble request. You can be so cruel. Then I also ask about my pros uh, ask about prospects. Will I be able to live a life by my choices and follow my heart down my own path? Yang Po, the laughing answer. So I can only fa face reality obediently and wait until God knows when. Do I have any other choice? I also ask, ask about family. Will my parents who quarrel and fight have a second chance together? Yang Po, the laughing answer. You cannot cry over split mi spilled milk. Is that so? Spilled milk. But that was my family. My mom and that person we used to smile and laugh together. Do I ask for too much? Is life just a never ending bitterness or is it all just me? Divine answer. So it is because of me. This stuff's getting real deep. Youth is hardly ever given a choice, pushed through the ground until their innocence fades away. I've become a wooden horse on the car carousel of life, a jumble mess of lifeless emotion. Infused with frantic energy, I spin ever faster. whispering somebody's whispering real creepily and I'm getting real close to my character and I don't like this what is this a radio seems like the static in the room is coming from this maybe I can get something if I tune in a bit The atmosphere in the room's changed. Oh, I'm back at home again? I didn't even get to save! Freak me. A ceramic picking bank. Big round eyes waiting to be fed. <laughs> you didn't have to say it like that. Can I walk out and leave? Someone's home. Oh, I can leave. Oh, I'm afraid. I feel like mom's always been a traditional housewife. She doesn't complain even when wronged. I really don't like that. What's her dad talk about now? What's she about to say about her dad? Is that an eye looking at him? Back then, besides the New Year's, dad never drank at home. I miss the days when he had jokes and stories to tell. Before we do anything, man, I'm about to go ahead and save the game. Before anything else happens. Give me back to this radio, please. Tell me back. Yep. Okay. Let me save. I'm going to go ahead and save and call it a. Uh a gameplay right there man part three uh i hope you guys enjoyed the game i am man this is pretty neat it's not like gameplay heavy but it's more story atmosphere focus and i really like that but i hope you guys enjoyed the video man if you didn't already go ahead and like comment subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next one peace